In this video, I'm going to teach you how to connect Razer Viper V3 Pro to PC. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm going to give you easy to follow instructions on how to properly set up and use your Razer Viper V3 Pro on a PC or laptop. It is primarily designed to be used in those platforms, so it is extremely simple to set up. First, you need to make sure that it is sufficiently charged. To do this, use the provided USB-C to USB-A cable and plug it into a suitable power source. You will still be able to use the mouse while it is charged. So once it is plugged in, it is going to begin charging immediately, and like I said, you will be able to use it right away, so it is plug and play. Now, after you are done charging the mouse, and you want to use it wirelessly, all that you have to do is grab the wireless dongle, and you will also be able to plug it into your PC. So instead of using the USB-A to USB-C cable and plugging it in directly to your mouse, just plug it in into the dongle. Put the dongle in close proximity of the mouse and if you look at the bottom there will be a toggle that you can press and hold for around 3 seconds to power it on. Once the mouse is powered on it will automatically connect to the wireless dongle and now every single subsequent time that you use the mouse it is going to automatically turn on and connect to the dongle. You will be able to use it completely wirelessly. So you can download the software on the Razer website if you prefer, but it is completely optional. You will have access to some more advanced features, but overall it is going to be entirely usable as soon as you plug it in, either to a cable, so a wired connection, or wirelessly with the dongle. You just have to make sure that you are in close proximity and that it has sufficient battery. If you need to charge it again, just remove the USB cable from the dongle and plug it in directly into the mouse instead. I hope I was able to help you on how to connect Razer Viper V3 Pro to PC. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching!